We're coming to you live from Tombstone, Arizona. It's sold out Chimera Stadium. This is global warming at its finest, folks. It's a scorching 116 degrees today, but thankfully, it's a dry heat. Both teams hit the field, ready to hit each other in this MFL matchup. The insane Colts go up against the Cardinal Sins. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Again, everybody, Grim Blitzrow here along with Brickhead Mulligan. That's me. And his mutant hobbit head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. How about you shut the fuck up? Well played, Jr. Moving on. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Seriously, man, you think you can go toe to toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. First and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. First and four. Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Second down at six. And he just, oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be 
thinking about that hit? Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Third and two. Sounded like a gorilla city with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And that'll bring up second and one. And that's another turnover for the defense. This guy's a brick shithouse. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And it's first and ten. Point with multiple interception. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. First down and less than eight. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> First down and seven. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Nice hit. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. And 
and then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Hey, what you talking about, Second and three. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every... And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? He's at the ten. It's a touchdown! They ought to activate landmines in the end zone during the dance celebrations. <laughs> Be a lot more entertaining, that's for sure. <laughs> and the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to eat those last two runners for this act, man. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pad, Rim. You're right. He could go all the way. They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a sub up right on this asshole. First and ten. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. Great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense could do anything to stop a thrown out good, man! You mean aside from priming the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim! The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice.
and it's first and ten. That was a good throw, and assuming he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And that'll bring up third and one. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And the offense, and like a monkey trying, and he held on to that one for a first down. Ghost about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? The offense has it. That was a clip. You ever get hit in the head with a bulldog grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to consider runners now and consider passing more. First down and one. Oh, man. Perfect pass and the score. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order? It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. First and ten. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. And let the work be dirty brick. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, they don't need him. Not until he's cooked. Hey, man, I was here on the now. You know what happened? Second down and a lot. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, nah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah. Uh, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Warp speed engaged. And he's running. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. And 
And that'll bring up second and one. And with a burst of speed, he finds an opening with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room straight through the uprights when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay First and ten. Four yards on that one. And boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? First and ten. They weren't even on the same page on that play. Second down and ten. for eight yards. Third and two. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this. Kid. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. First and ten. You know what they say? Sometimes the best offense and the same drop back. You want more bills and also turn into the real match. The game just keeps evolving, don't it? Back to my day, we had an electric carving knife. Let them long extension cords made it tough, though. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids are gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> the offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking. 
looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. You can't keep a good mutant down. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And it's first and ten. Signals a hurry up. Uh, same as Bridges' ex girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. They could not connect on that play. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. chip shot here extra point but this guy could blow it the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just guineas let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever It certainly left skid marks. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked down? just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the... The offense is running low on blockers. They have only two left. They lose another. It's game over. And it's first to ten. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. And he's going to work a dirty trick. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know what's going to be. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. Seriously, man, you think you 
go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, you get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Pass play nets them seven yards. Ah, uh, no. I got the... <laughs> the offense is no running backs left, so they will lose all running plays in their playbook. Second and three. He refuses to go down. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go. First and ten. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. He broke free and has open field in front of him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First down and six. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. I think you ought to be able to shoot a guy in the end zone doing a dance like that. For extra points, you know? Plus, it would speed the game up. Hey, good point. <laughs> <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Bricks? Hey, have you seen my beer? And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Don't worry. If he shocks you to death, maybe he can shock He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. First down in a mile. And that is a big gain. You know the defense.
Savage wants some payback after that. Second down and six. And that is caught for a first down. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. chip shot here extra point but this guy could blow it straight through the uprights the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score hey speak for yourself I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring man what a hit that was First and ten. He like bricks his bowels. He is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. gets another pick. No, he just got popped big time. Oh, my God. I thought his head was going to pop off like a big zit. And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. Yep. He's coming out in the field now. with multiple interceptions. The QB should just throw in the towel. And he's off to the races. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Look at that little mutant run! I don't think you can say that, Graham. Oh, boy. First down and nine. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. Second and three. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. And he 
breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The twenty, and they're catching up. Joke, job, do something. <laughs> talking about he's just dancing that's a normal human who is dancing don't make any mistakes here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room the kick is good and as expected those are pretty much just gimmies here comes the kicker oh, i can't wait to hear this what's the kicker grin uh, this guy in the field oh i thought you were gonna tell me a story like here's the kicker when i turned on the light it wasn't a broad in my bed it was a chip wearing a wig the offense has only two linemen left on the offense and will need to play shorthanded the rest of the game hey don't say mean things about short people grin at least they don't look down on people and it's first and ten Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Ready for that bombs away dirty trick that time. Third down and forever. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. And it's first to ten. <laughs> The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Uh, we are. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. <laughs> the Cardinals fans ruthlessly destroy the opposition and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about if, how about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.